This is a 4x4 Rubik's Cube, and this is the beginning of a 160 kilometer or 100 mile loop that I'm gonna use to solve this 4x4 one turn per kilometer. Let's get this 4x4 scrambled up. Okay, I scrambled up the 4x4, and now I have to solve it one turn per kilometer. Now, my only goal is to get this done in less than 160 moves, which is 160 kilometers and 100 miles. So let's go. All right, I'm gonna rotate the cube to face white on the bottom and yellow on the top. And then I'm gonna do my first move for the first kilometer, a BW. Oh, and did I mention my other challenge? I only have one day to finish this challenge. So I guess we better speed up a bit. Two kilometers, R prime. Three kilometers, BW2. Four kilometers, D2. Five kilometers, BW prime. And the first center is complete. Six kilometers, B prime. Seven kilometers, DW2. Eight kilometers, D. Nine kilometers, RW. Ten kilometers, F2. Guess I better be careful where I step because there's a lot of poison ivy up here. Anyway, that is the place where I solved the 7x7 and the 11x11 under the sunset. But now, I'm gonna keep going straight. Kilometer 11, RW prime, and the first two centers are complete. Oh yes, somewhere I don't want to be for 12 kilometers. DW prime, kilometer 13. This L prime deserves the bad luck number. The trail ended, so now I'm on the road. Hopefully, it won't last too long. 14 kilometers, F prime. And luckily, I'm almost to the end of the road after I go through this tree. 15 kilometers, DW2. There's the third center. Kilometer 16, L2. Kilometer 17, B2. Kilometer 18, DW prime. For kilometer 19, I'm gonna do a U prime to save this edge pair from getting broken. That might have been a waste of moves, but oh well. Wow, look at that canyon down there. That's a pretty view. Kilometer 20, B. 21 kilometers, L2. And it looks like the canyon I was looking at is now down there. 22 kilometers, DW2. 23 kilometers, L2. 24 kilometers, UW2, to finish the centers and start working on the edges. 25 kilometers, B, and I am entering the forest. 26 kilometers, D. 27 kilometers, B prime. This is a neat looking bridge. Man, these trees smell good. 28 kilometers, F. 29 kilometers, U2. 30 kilometers, F prime. 31 kilometers, UW. 32 kilometers, U. 33 kilometers, B prime. 34 kilometers, L. I have quite a view from here. Now that is an amazing view. 35 kilometers, B prime. 36 kilometers, U. Okay, which way should I go? I pick this way. 37 kilometers, L2. 38 kilometers, B. 39 kilometers, F. Wow, I am high up here. And here I am at 40 kilometers, U prime. 41 kilometers, F prime. 42 kilometers, UW. 43 kilometers, R. I just can't stop looking at that amazing view, even though it's cloudy. 44 kilometers, U prime. Uh oh, it looks like the trail is a dead end, and the way you're supposed to go is to jump off a cliff. Oh, it doesn't look like it. It looks like the trail keeps going. All right, 45 kilometers, R prime, and a good place to stop for lunch with the view in the background. All right, now let's keep going. 46 kilometers, F prime. 47 kilometers, D2. 48 kilometers, F. 49 kilometers, L. And for 50 kilometers, U prime. 51 kilometers, L prime. Who decided they wanted to flood the trail? Now I have to walk through that. Uh oh, looks like this trail is expert level. Well, here come the hard parts. 52 kilometers. R prime, 53 kilometers, U prime, 
54 kilometers R. And for 55 kilometers, UW Prime, and I have finished all of the edges. Let's hope we don't get double parry. Wow, that is a lot of poison ivy. 56 kilometers, F prime. 57 kilometers, R. That was hard to climb up. More poison ivy, as usual. 58 kilometers, U prime. 59 kilometers, L2. And here we are at 60 kilometers, B. 61 kilometers, U. 62 kilometers, B. 63 kilometers, F prime. Finished across with two F2L pairs. 64 kilometers, R prime. 65 kilometers, U2, and it just started raining. 66 kilometers, F. Kilometer 67, R. It's getting windy. I didn't expect there to be a storm out here. Why does there have to be a storm? Kilometer 68, F prime, first two F2L pairs. And it is a lot of rain going on right now. This is quite the storm. Kilometer 69, L, and look at all that rain over there. Kilometer 70, U2, and there is a lot of rain. I think I'm gonna need to clean out my 4x4. 71 kilometers, R prime, and um, wow. My shoes are getting heavier and heavier, and there's no way of stopping that. 72 kilometers, B prime. 73 kilometers, U prime. 74 kilometers, B, and there's our third F2L pair. 75 kilometers, U prime. 76 kilometers, L prime. 77 kilometers, U. 78 kilometers, L. Check out those amazing clouds. 79 kilometers, U2. And we have gone 80 kilometers. Let's do an F. 81 kilometers, U. Kilometer 82, F2. And the sun is finally coming out. 83 kilometers, L prime. 84 kilometers, U prime. 85 kilometers, L. 86 kilometers, U. 87 kilometers, F. And for PLL, we have a parody. Wow, that lake is very low today. 88 kilometers, B. 89 kilometers, U. 90 kilometers, B prime. 91 kilometers, RW2. 92 kilometers, F2. 93 kilometers, U2. 94 kilometers, RW2, and I reached the end of the trail, unfortunately. 95 kilometers, R2. 96 kilometers, U2. Kilometer 97, F2. 98 kilometers, RW2. 99 kilometers, B. And there is a rainbow up ahead. And for 100 kilometers, U prime. 101 kilometers, B prime. And for my last turn, at 102 kilometers, this was the longest distance I have ever walked in one day. I am going to do a U2 to finish solving this 4x4, one turn per kilometer. Now, I need to get back. Alright guys, after 12 hours and I think 56 minutes of hiking, I am finally back to where I started. So I'm going to head home now. This was definitely one of the hardest challenges I have ever done because I've never walked this far in one day and my feet are so tired and probably bleeding right now. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed the video and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.